Artist Tips Episode 6. Learn how to market yourself. So marketing is a lot of trial and error and it's a lot of research. It's not a lot, but it's enough of it to where, by the way, what you're looking at is a, a print that was given away for the game that I'm the uh, I'm the lead artist, excuse me, sorry, the lead artist and uh, concept designer for called Bane of Empires. It was created by Ivan Rodriguez and it uh, will be out in August. That is the initial launch date for the game. So I figured I would just put a pretty picture there. So for those of you, I'm going to give you guys a little peek behind the curtain to kind of show you some stuff. Obviously, if you've clicked on this, then you are watching this on YouTube and you know that I have a YouTube channel in which I make videos. I have a free figure drawing set of videos that I keep up there they're absolutely free and they're also I also have a I'm, I did I'm starting this series where it's artist tips where I try to give you guys useful advice and real world advice because I think that's way more important than drawing teaching you how to I don't know draw cute manga boy hair you know, or whatever the the going. Not that there's anything wrong with those videos. I'd, I, I would, uh, I think I'll maybe if that gives me a lot of hits, then that'll be great. I'll try teach you how to draw cute manga boy hair, which I don't know how to draw. But so uh, for those of you that don't know, uh, my my anatomy product is called was called Draw Better Anatomy, but since there are about 20 videos, you could do a video a day and do some drawing and sketching and you could learn how to draw the human form in about 30 days so I switched the name to 30 day anatomy and look right now this is me marketing to you by the way as uh, I want you guys to take notes because this is the stuff that I want to see you guys doing you have uh, and if you click on that it does press play but you guys are actually in my back office of Selfie so uh, if you buy now you can you can watch the lesson first and if it's something that you like and if it's uh, you know something that you found helpful and if my other videos have helped you then you can just you can get it for 40% off right now so what I was gonna do originally with the 30 day anatomy was put that course on Udemy which is a larger marketplace for artists or for instructors to sell their wares as it were but I've decided to change what I'm going to do on Udemy for the reason that, and this is another little peek behind the curtain, is that Udemy tends to offer these sales that are like 10, sometimes they'll probably put your product out there for like $10. Sometimes they have free coupons and I guess, and you could take part in that or not. So I figured that it would not be fair to the people that have bought 30 day anatomy. So what I was going to, so what I'm going to do now is that my Udemy class is going to change to a 30 day drawing class. It will have some anatomy. It'll have things on perspective and um, it'll be a generalized drawing class for people. And so that way, the people that already bought 30 day anatomy, they'll get free coupons. And you know something, let me just make this offer to you guys too. If you guys want to buy 30 day anatomy, I have everybody's, uh, uh, emails because I do send updates to 230 day anatomy there's a, a a pretty significant update coming coming pretty soon but uh, if you guys want to uh, grab the 30 day anatomy for the 40 percent off then when I release the Udemy course um, they do like for you to give out free coupons I'm just gonna give it the free coupons to the people that have already you know that have already why not give it to you guys so that's that's the offer that I'm gonna make so if you guys want to do that go right ahead um, but um, in that way that you also get extra value you get some of this extra stuff like uh, you've already got the anatomy course but then you can learn how to do some cool stuff uh, when it comes to like perspective and I'll talk about rendering and, and things of that nature so with your marketing you definitely want to get a YouTube channel you don't have to get a YouTube channel maybe that's not your thing but um, you definitely will want to get your Facebook Facebook join some Facebook groups start posting your artwork out there jump on Fiverr um, 
I would say that you know when you're working on Fiverr, you know just know what you're doing. I, I would say don't do anything too labor intensive on Fiverr unless you're charging labor intensive money. And there's a whole thing with Fiverr, which I'm about to start doing, or I've been doing actually, uh, ebook covers because that's more design and it's less illustration. Not that I wouldn't illustrate something, but uh, I wouldn't illustrate anything for five dollars. That's just an, out of the question. And as an artist, you have to know what you're worth. You also have to know what you're going to charge. And people are always asking, like, well, what do you charge? It depends on your pain threshold. So if you are drawing something, if you're making doodles for five dollars and let's say you're making like some kind of stick figurey kind of thing where well, that's your cool art style, you have to know what you're going to charge for that so that when you're done with it, you're not so exhausted in the money you get where you're not like, Oh, that wasn't worth it at all. So I, I you definitely want to, you know, something for a full color uh, image with one or two characters and a background. I, I would say, and I've, I've heard this say before, you should you should at very least start at a hundred bucks. I mean, I know I'm, you know, maybe I'm not supposed to say that or whatever, but I, I would say that because if you think about it, if you worked on and you know this this something like this would cost cost a little bit more because there is think about what you have to do just for the figures alone you have to draw them you got to sketch it out first you got to sketch it you have to draw it you have to ink it you have to color it you have to render it it's a lot of work a lot a lot of work so uh, just keep in mind that if you're doing something like that then let's look at it like this if you charged a hundred bucks or say 100 to maybe three hundred dollars for a full on something something similar to this I did some 3d stuff in the background with Bryce but uh, still I had to do it um, it was still labor I want you to look at it this way if you had five orders like that how much would you make during the week is it gonna take you all day if you worked all day and you made a hundred bucks that's not bad it's not a bad day if you made more that'd be even better so I would say learn how to market yourself and, and along with marketing yourself comes with improving your skills. Do what you got to do to improve your skills, because the more that you improve your skills and the other reason why it made, you know, 30 day anatomy is because you, maybe you don't have a lot of time. Maybe you don't have a lot of time. Chances are you don't. And the more that you know how to draw and the better your skills are, the quicker you can work and the more money that you can make. So hope you enjoyed these tips. Um, I don't know. Check it out. Uh, check out uh, 30 Day Anatomy. And uh, remember, market yourself and don't undervalue yourself as an artist. All right, guys. Peace.